Yo, what is up guys? Welcome to another Ross Find videos. And today's video we're gonna be shopping. Um seeing if we find any new shoes. As you can see here, we freaking struck gold. We found some weightlifting Adidas shoes. Um not bad price at all. So these were definitely a pickup. And um going through more of the aisles, I find these Adidas Predator. Um these are amazing cleats. Um the price for these is pretty pretty good because um they're from like a different country so i'm not complaining about that um always for prices for cleats can be around that 25 dollars range or 19 dollars but you can't complain man um here we're at burlington and we actually found some more cleats and these are like some i believe they're like football cleats um so you already know those were a pickup i haven't seen those in a while and look how many baseball cleats we found guys these Adidas and white combo, just $19.99, going for about $60. So, you know, these were definitely a pickup. Um, we got a couple sizes here, and we also found a black one, um, which is pretty cool. There was a bunch of these at the Burlington, so you already know I had to pick those up. It's going to be like $20 profit for each of them. Can't go wrong with those. Moving on, we are at a different store. It's my first time hitting up uh, Play-Doh's Closet. We find these Nike like Air Max. Uh, pretty cool. I like the colors or like galaxy um, And um, yeah, so I decided to pick it up. It's not going for much since it's pre-owned um, As you can see there like even though it looks brand new It's pre-owned because it's Plato's closet. You know what I mean? So I can't sell it for like as new Whereas like at Ross and stuff you sell it new um, Anyways speaking about Ross. I did find this cool Nike jacket uh, Extra small the retail price on that is 130 and we only paid 30 bucks so you already know that's a cop, especially we're in the winter time. Hopefully some girl uh, buys it. I'm not sure who though, because I don't even like the design on that jacket. Um, anyways, looking through the toy aisle, you already know Christmas is coming up. Um, I never got any luck, but today I um, kind of got a little lucky. As you can see here, I got a Hot Wheels. Um, found a Hot Wheels for like $16. It's going for about $40. First time I see a Hot Wheel profitable. And um, I was just looking around. There's a whole bunch of Nerf, like... Hello Nerf, um, never seen this much Nerf at a Ross. I really wish I could sell those, but they're just too high of a price and Amazon prices them really, really low. So you're basically just earning like a dollar like profit. Um, this Power Ranger sword was actually pretty profitable too, but not enough for me. Um, some more Nerf stuff, they even have some cool Monopoly stuff, like Mario Edition, they even had like a Pac-Man. So those are pretty cool um but yeah a lot of nerf even like nerf fortnite stuff more hot wheels but not profitable which um i'm just gonna have to leave them in the store but always check the toy aisle especially christmas being around the corner um these are pretty good actually these boxing gloves these pink boxing gloves going for about 15 dollars, and i just sell them for uh, 40. so you already know those were a pickup and looking over um i found some peanut stuff and these are only 10 dollars, and they're selling for 30. So you already know how to pick those from the shelf. They only had two, but I picked both of them up still. So a little Christmas Christmas stuff selling here, which is all new to me, all new to me. And always check the luggages, guys. Look, this is a money-making uh, spot. Only $30 for these luggages, and you sell them for like 100 So I had to cop these. And, um, yeah, I just kept looking around the store. Didn't find much. Um... But yeah, uh, this one goes for about $85, I think. Not $100, but it's close. It's still really good. Looking at the clothes, I didn't see much, but I did find this really cool um, jersey. It's like a, a Rockies jersey. I'm not sure how you say it. Um, my size, too. I was so close to buying it for myself. But um, I, I didn't end up buying it. It's uh, $30. I didn't know if it would sell. But it's, I find it pretty cool. They sell like Nike jerseys, like Nike official jerseys at Ross. Um, never like really seen any. I sell a lot of football ones, you know, but baseball, never seen it. We didn't find too many items for today's video, but um, let's go ahead and check out what profits we're coming out with. Alrighty guys, let's see how much money we're walking away with in today's video. Right behind me, I have a computer. It's gonna be telling me um, how much we've paid for the items and how much we're selling them and the profit we're walking away with. So if we add all the costs together, I'm talking like every single item we paid for this video, it's going to amount to about $290.89. That is how much we paid for all the items that you saw in today's video. And um, for the sellings price, so when we sell all the items, the amount that's going to be is going to be $775.63. 
um, that is in total sales. And then um, the magic number you guys are all been waiting for is how much profit we made in just today's video alone. Um, before I say the number, I just want to say a huge thank you for all those who um, watch my videos and support me. I really do appreciate all you guys. Um, go ahead and comment so I can just reply to you guys and show some love back. Um, again, guys, thank you so much. And if you are new to the channel, don't be scared. Subscribe. And I'll be making so much more videos on how to make money on Amazon and eBay. Um, enough said. The profit we walked away with is going to be $278.91. That is if you add all the items together, um, subtracting all the fees, shipping fees, literally everything. That is how much money we're walking away with and putting in our pockets. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, make sure you drop a like below, comment um, what you want to see next. And I really do appreciate everything you guys done. I hope you guys had a happy holidays. And um, enough said, I hope you guys have a good one. And I'll see you on the next video.